Today in my mind there are three groups of Nigerians. First, there are those Nigerians who no longer believe in Nigeria. If you ask them why, they'll tell you that the nomadic Fulani has nothing in common with the entrepreneurial Igbo. In the second group are those Nigerians who would like to keep believing in Nigeria, who are hopeful. This group of Nigerians are deeply contradicted within themselves. If you ask them what is it, they'll tell you it's the memories of going to a federal government college, of being posted as a youth copper to some exotic parts of the country back in the days when you could leave Bauchi by three in the afternoon to start heading to Meduguri by road. For reasons like this, Nigerians in this group find it hard to give up on the country. But with every new news of yet another example of Nigeria's seeming hopelessness, their hearts break a little bit more. Nigerians in this group are full of pain. They see Nigeria not as it is, but as it could be. That Nigeria has a purpose and that Nigeria will hold together until that purpose is fulfilled.